Rox, let's see what you got out of the sand. Go to this flag right there. Nice shot. Beautiful shot. So we're going to work a little bit out of the sand because so many times I've seen juniors take maximum hole scores just because they hit a shot into the bunker. And that's just devastating to take a 10. If 10 is a maximum score, sometimes they don't have a maximum and you're stuck in the trap all day. How horrible is that? You hit one bad shot in a bunker and you lose a tournament just because you didn't practice correctly. So we're gonna do a little drill and then we're going to work on that for a couple minutes. Sound good? Yeah. Watch this. All we're gonna do is just draw a line. Now, all I want you to do, this line represents where I want you to hit the ball or where I want you to hit the sand. You're gonna set up, bend your knees, and you're gonna hit the line right in front of the line the whole time. Right there, just right in front of the line. Oh, okay. I hit behind the line. I don't wanna do that. I wanna hit on the line, just on the front edge of that line. And we wanna work this whole line. So set up, open that face, swing and hit some sand. Perfect. Too far in front of it, right on the line. Stop. So wide stance, wide stance. Okay, good. And you wanna swing through, this, this needs to be in the middle of your stance. It's a little too far, or forward, perfect. Set up perfect, hit the front of the line. Love it, a little too far behind. Bend your knees more. All I'm doing is giving you some direction as you go. Bend your knees. Too deep, shallow it out. Less sand, bend your knees. Good, stop. Is it in the middle of your stance? Bend your knees, lower. Good, get your arms away from your body. Don't touch your, there you go. Good, keep your knees bent. Stop, I want you to keep your knees bent the whole way as you swing. Bend your knees, your knees your best friend. Open that face, get your arms away from your body. Great, swing through, hit the line. Stop, beautiful. Good. I love it. That was a beautiful, work that whole line. Keep going. So as a, as a golf instructor, if I'm doing more talking than my student is doing hitting or swinging, we have a huge problem. Stop, you didn't hit the line. Oh. Bend your knees. Do it. That, I love that. So golf can be the most boring sport in the world, can't it? Yeah. Good, you're done. Now, let me rake the line a little. So golf can be super boring if you make it boring. And what's boring is having people talk all the time, isn't it? Yeah. yeah. So now what we're gonna do is the same thing. There's the line. I just draw a line for you. Now you're going to the flag, always pick a flag. That flag over there. Good, hit the line. That was nice. Wrong hole. You wanna go to that hole? No. There's your line. Open that face. Swing through, hit that line. Good, too much ball. Too much, got too much ball. Hit the line, open the face, bend your knees. Get away from the ball. Swing through. That was perfect shot, look at this, go in. You almost made it. You almost made it, did you get that? That was great, hit that line. Swing through. Okay, remember, when we're working here, we're working on getting the ball out of the trap. Technique will come. You have great technique. We're just working on hitting that line. Not bad. What we're trying to avoid is a giant score. And a giant score comes from staying in the trap for too long. Take it back, swing, hit the line. This, this kind of stuff equals giant score, right? Yeah. That's what we're trying to get rid of. That's why we're here practicing. Aim, fix your aim, open that face, hit that line. Perfect swing, perfect shot. The more we, time we spend in here, the more confidence we have, the more confidence we have, the less we care about going in a sand trap. Perfect shot. So it's super simple if we do the right things. We practiced on the line, hit the line. You don't have to have a ball to be good out of a sand. 
You could be the greatest sand shot player and you could spend two hours practicing and never hit a ball and then be on the golf course and hit every shot out of the trap close to the hole. You don't have to hit a ball out of the bunker to get good at it. You just have to know exactly where your club is going to hit the sand. If you know that, you can do anything you want out of the sand trap. If you know where the bottom of the club is going to hit. No problem. So there's a lot of things I could say about that shot. Oh, you slowed down, you decelerated, you did all this stuff. But like I said, we don't have to worry about that. We have to worry about we got out and that's the goal. Second goal is let's get it close to the hole. But let's hit your line, get good setup, push those arms out, swing through, hit that line. Great shot. There's your practice. Draw a line. This week you're going to draw lines in the sand. You're going to do the whole line, at least 10, 15 feet of a line. Sound good? Yeah. And then you're going to hit maybe 20, 25 balls every day. Is that easy? Yeah. You're pretty good. Mm -hmm. Great stuff. Mm -hmm. You're going to be the sand crab of the bunkers on the golf course. Cool. You're going to be getting like, that's where I love to be. Good work. Keep it up. Hi everybody, it's Matt with Junior Golf House. Thanks for stopping by. Please subscribe to our channel so we can keep you up to date with all the latest tips, drills, techniques, lessons, so you can get better at this crazy game. And follow along on Facebook and Instagram. All those links are below. Also check us out on our website, hit them straight, and we'll see you real soon.